Ground Zero. The label of the future, nigga. Hey, it's your boy Diane the Mac, TGLD, man. I'm locked in with Ground Zero. Like, when it comes to you as an artist, though, like, how would you describe your, you know, your creativity? Like, you as an artist, like, what type of artist are you? Man, for the most part, like, um, you know, I'm 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 a trap rapper, street rapper. You know, I do that, but at the same time, though, like, you can just go listen to my shit and you will know, like, I ain't that, I ain't that average rapper. Man, my homeboy told me, <laughs> my homeboy told me to get on this bitch and tell them shit, man, I'm harder than all the rappers that's, that's out in the industry. But I really just say, I really just say, like, I ain't got no, like, you can't categorize me. You feel me? Like, I can go on any level. So you, you put, versatile, so like yeah, you just yeah. never know what you gonna, you know. Man, you, you can know put a country you beat on. You can put a country beat on. No, you not rocking it. out to no country. I swear to God, nigga, if I'm if I'm feeling it. Yeah. So look, I'm, when it when it come to you recording, like walk me through the process of like, boom, you you hit the studio, you find a beat. Like, is it some more so like you got to sit down and write, or like you just go off of the vibe and the energy and like you punch in type shit. Yeah, it it, it just depends. Like, um, the, the album that I did before. Before I went to the Fizz, man, I punched in that whole album. It's called Scotty Flippin'. It's on uh, it's on Apple Music. You just search Danger the Mac. It's on Apple Music. I punched in that whole fucking album. Like I really ain't write shit. If I wrote if I wrote some, it was something I had a feature on or something like that. But man, I ain't just write shit. But like I write and I punch. It just depend on the beat, really, man. I'm telling you, like once you. Once you turn that beat on, if I'm feeling that hoe, if, if, if that motherfucker liked it, I'ma go in. It don't matter how I come. It don't matter if I if I write on this motherfucker, if I punch. If I'm feeling the beat like that, I'ma go in on that hoe. Moving forward, you know, the rest of 2021, going into 2022, what can the people expect, you know, from that? Man, really just keeping this shit in their face, man. Like, I've been on so many platforms in the last couple of weeks like just interviews after interviews i've been on famous animal i've been on spade tv i'm going on off the porch i'm going on uh dope academy tv i'm study shooting videos like i just dropped this tape right here the god it's out on our platform right now you can go man, download the stream or whatever like man i got x amount of videos on on, on youtube on, under danger to make tv like, I'm really just keeping it in their face and making sure, like, man, people see this shit. Because niggas ain't going to look for this shit, you know what I'm saying? So you got to bring it to them. You mentioned, you know, you got to bring it to them. That all come with marketing. Like, it when you come to everything, all right, do you have a team or, like, a management you working with? Or is it this just all you? Man, to be real, like, I ain't even really just got no team or no management. Um, Like, I'm finna go, I'm finna go to Cali in a couple of weeks. I'm finna go to Cali in a couple of weeks and holler at these niggas, man. They, they, uh, they talking about managing me. They want to see what they can do, like, for our distribution and, you know, just helping a nigga push this shit a little bit more. But, uh, really, man, other than a couple of homeboys, it really ain't no team. Like, like we the team. You know what I'm saying? And shit, sometimes I be feeling like shit. I'm a, I'm a one-man army because no matter what, if don't nobody go with me, I'm going to go. You, know what you got saying? to whatever I, whatever yeah. I set out to do, I'm gonna go do that shit. Whether it's whether it's ten or one. If you don't, who would? Man, facts. So you yeah. know, like outside of your city, you know, you mentioned a couple artists, you know, but like just from the state as a whole, is there any you know artists that you fucking with? You tapped in with? Oh, uh, I ain't gonna lie, like I ain't really just 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 tapped in with nobody, but you know, I be. I be doing my homework, seeing like like who who liked it, you know what I'm saying? Like who who I feel like it's hard, you know? Like uh, Wes Miffy got uh, YTB Fat, that young nigga hard as a motherfucker. Um, it's a nigga from I, I think he from Little Rock, but I ain't sober. Nigga named uh, SG Santana, nigga mm -hmm. named Eleven Hundred Facts. Like it's it's a couple motherfuckers that like niggas really ain't just getting they just do, but they hard as a motherfucker. Especially, especially that little nigga, uh, man, uh, YTB Fat. That nigga, that nigga really hard as fuck. He slept on, but he, he ain't slept on, but he slept on. 
for the for the simple fact like his Instagram go up, but it's just like these niggas be doing these rap lists and all this shit. Nigga really don't be, you know what I'm saying? Like nigga don't be putting a nigga putting a nigga on that bitch, but you know, niggas homeboy probably doing the motherfucker. You know, it really ain't no telling, but that shit don't mean nothing anyway. Niggas still gonna pop if they gonna pop. You feel me? When it come to a rap list though, like have you ever been mentioning one? See, locally, you know, like around the town, but like I say, like a lot of motherfuckers don't. It's so many motherfuckers doing music, bro. Like you really can't even be stressed about no about no rap list, cause man, like I said, a nigga homeboy might be doing this motherfucker, and and then nine times out of ten they just doing it off the motherfuckers that they a world. They don't be. They don't just too much be going and doing no homework and trying to find out like who in this section, who in this section, who who from over here, you know what I'm saying? Who from Southeast, who from Central, who from they might they might do a little homework, but man, it be it be my artists out of diamonds they it's a lot of diamonds in the rough. You feel me? Like really? it's a lot of niggas that 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 you will never get tapped in with this. Man, probably killing the rap list. You feel me? Yeah, shit. Like I, that's what I just said. Like the past couple people who done got signed, I ain't never seen that name on name one rap list. You know, yeah. shit. Then boom, they get they yeah. get snatched by real deal labels. Yeah, cause niggas niggas be hard, but uh, motherfuckers just don't be knowing. They just like they like they like on um, Geno Great. See, like, he another one. Like I know Great hard as a motherfucker on that rap shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? Big bag both. Nigga from Jordan, Arkansas, man. Nigga hard as a motherfucker on there. He got the song called Arkansas. That shit so bumping, bro. Real shit. So look, when you back in your city, you know, like I love the hood spots. I go grab something to eat, you know. Like what's 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 some what you what you eat? Man, shit. Oh, uh, we got we got King's Barbecue. King's Barbecue. That's my boy. Oh, uh, that's my boy Bryce. Shit. Man, I'm talking about. Fire chicken wings, no. fish, ribs, turkey legs, all type of shit. You got uh, you got uh, damn, you got amazing chicken, amazing, amazing chicken and fish. Uh, that's California raw shit. They just open this shit up. It, it's a late night spot. Like I think it closed like eleven, twelve, some shit like that. Um, you got Maze Grill. That's like the soul food, son. Maze, the nigga gonna go to Maze get a plate. Man, you gotta go in there Wednesday. They motherfucking fried chicken, uh, uh, fried chicken, sweet potato, spaghetti. Oh, you been on that, man? They, man, I'm telling you. Oh, they got like a sweet spot um, called Orange Sweets. Um, they make all type of shit, cupcakes, all type of shit. No, definitely. You know, I fuck with that food, though. No cap. So, but yeah, though, man, go ahead and let the folks know where they can find you on social media. Yo, man. One more time, let me point this shit in their face, man. Danger the Mad, the God mixtape. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Apple Music, Spotify, YouTube, Audio Mac, whatever you, whatever you want. Shit, nine times out of ten, it's on. You can find me on on, on Facebook at Danger the Mac or uh, the Biggest Mac. You can find me on Snapchat, Instagram at Danger the Mac T G O D. That's D A N G E R D A M A C T G O D. Then on YouTube, Danger the Mac TV or just Danger the Mac. My topic page is gonna pull up. Yeah, shit. And before we wrap it up, you know what's something positive you'll leave the streets with? Man, <laughs> this shit ain't what you think it is. Like motherfuckers be motherfuckers be thinking their life like. Like it's on the it's on the glorify just cause you see every rapper, every rapper talking about this dope and you know what I'm saying, nigga popping purse and all this shit, like this shit ain't even what it wrapped up to be and then motherfuckers be thinking like everything be real, everything you see on the on these videos and all this shit, that shit don't be real nine times out of ten. Like sometimes it do, but majority of the time it don't.